welcome to the next episode of this career mode. Um, yeah. Oh! Uh, maybe we can negotiate with these. I'll take their keeper. Oh, not 19 million. We don't want to do that. You know what? We'll buy a new keeper. So if we're buying a new keeper, mm. if we're buying a new keeper, we need to first of all look for one on the transfer market. Someone who's got oh wrong thing. <laughs> We'll go with four loan. I'll try and get him on loan. Now the button will still get his games in the cup. We were just going to pay for the whole wage. If he signed, obviously, but if not, then we'll just get. We'll put Button in there, obviously. This is just a precaution, he might not even go yet. So. That's Coventry in this game. Should be very interesting. As we're just looking to move the squad around a little bit. Get a couple of players in that will not be playing really in the league. So we've got players off the bench that, if we need to, can bring on and probably bag a goal or two. This should be very exciting. Against Coventry then. And the Carabao Cup. Alright, let's get into this game. Just looking to get fitness into the players that wouldn't really be playing in the league. But could obviously come on as a sub, like Alex Might and, and Furlong. Robson Connor were looking to move out the club really. And then obviously any like young players we get like from the scouts and whatever we could uh, put on. Oh.
We've had a poor first five minutes for passing the ball around. Not really got many passes off. That's a great ball into Robson Carnu. Oh, let's just quickly do something. Mighton scores the first goal of his career at uh, West Brom. Well, on his loan spell. Hello. I'm back. <laughs> so Mighton scores the first goal. I don't know. Mighton scores the first goal um, at West Brom on his loan spell from Forest. Yeah, it shouldn't have been foul really, it didn't really do much to him, but oh well. 1 0 up then. We had a poor first five minutes. We've had a poor first five minutes of the game and then we sort of eased into the, the game and started having chances. Oh, Mighton, great turn from Mighton there. Can he go for a little run into the box maybe? Yep, he does. And it's 2-0. Weaver gets the first goal of his um, time at West Brom as well. The young academy player... Up front, Mighton gets an assist as well. He's had a great game so far. Robson Carney looking to maybe try and make it 3 0. Oh, it's a free kick, apparently. Video. We're going to shoot with Grzycki. It's a goal! We've scored a free kick. Great free kick there from Grzycki. Well done to him there. So, three players get the first goals this season for the club. Oh. Weaver picking up. He's running to the box. He makes it 4 0. We're no quicks in this game, there's no point of us playing. When we're four 0 up already, well done to the lads. Great little run out from all the players that wouldn't really be starting. We've got Newcastle next. Johnston's been sold. We've got nine million now. No.
Alright. So Southampton have signed Johnston, so we're going to have to go looking in the market for a new keeper. So look at this, some Premier League keepers that might want to join us. They want someone young so then they can carry their career on here at um, West Brom. Um, we're going to try and get Zach Steffen. Probably not going to work, but we'll try. Isn't looking lying, okay. Well, we've got, I don't know how much money to spend. We've got 15 million, so we're going to put about 10 million on him, maybe. Oh! He's just st stormed out on us there. Oh yeah, we've already got that keeper coming in online. My bad, I forgot about that. But, oh, we've got Newcastle away in this game. Let's take some of these players out. Not at a low on energy at the moment. <laughs> Look at the bench. <laughs> Not got one single um, centre back on there. We don't have any other centre backs. This is what we need from the. We might have to sign some free agents, maybe. Oh, I hate the shadow on uh, Newcastle's pitch when it's in the sun. Makes the pitch look very ugly. Not really seen much of Kurzawa since we signed him. Not really done much in the last episode. Obviously, we've subbed him off, or not, we took him out of the last game because it was Coventry and we were 4 one in up and we looked like we were going to win that game anyway. But now it's time for Button to step up in net until maybe the keeper that we're trying to get on loan signs. And then we'll obviously play him. I think. That's a great save there. Oh! Dean Garner doesn't quite keep the ball. This button saves it again, or catches it again. Oh, poor pass there from Grant. Pereira's not making a run, so we can't give it to him. Oh, there we go. Oh, it's Kazar on the run, though. Oh. And Bubba.
The rest giving a free kick right on the edge. Maybe some magic from Pereira this time. When we can angle it up, right? Okay, it's... Oh, we've hit the... I think we've saved that, or we've hit the bar, but... Unlucky from Pereira. He's one of the people that we don't really want to sell any time this season, or any time really. He's been so good for us at the start of the season, and in the pre-season tournament. Maitland-Niles puts us one up. Against Newcastle. West Brom are having a storm of a season here. We're doing so well. We haven't really changed the team since we've come in. We've only made a couple of signings. Great ball from Pereira. Poor pass from Grant, though. Oh, they're in. Oh, no. Newcastle have scored. Oh, no. St. Maximum. Probably their most dangerous player on the pitch at the moment. It's because I was not making a run to for Pereira to pass it in, pass to him. Pereira's picked it up though, right on the edge. Gives it to Dean Garner, into Maitland Niles, into Grant. Oh, puts it well wide. Half an hour in then. And it's 1 1. So. Not done too bad, we haven't. We should be maybe 2 1 up. If we score that free kick, then it might be a different game. But as it stands, Newcastle still in it. And we're still in the game. Oh. Pereira nearly st um, gets one in the back of the net. Maitland Niles has been so good. This season as well. Been one of the standouts. Obviously, I know he's only just bagged his first or second goal this season, but we won't mind. He's just done some great performances as he picks up again. Not really seen much of Dean Garner since we cha uh, changed the formation to a 4 5 1. I think both teams will just be happy to take the half time at 1 1. To be honest. Maitland Niles looking to break away. Dean Garner picks it up. We've scored again! Great goal there from Phillips. He's been another great player as well. 2 1 my Brom. Right near half time. Got a load of reserve people on the bench, so we're not going to be really making too many subs. Maybe give some of the reserve players a couple of minutes off on the pitch. Grant picks it up. This could be free one right before half time. It is. West Brom free one up right on half time.
But we've done very well there to pull two goals right on the end of the first half. Well, let's we'll start the second half. We're having a great season. I'm going to look at the table after this game and see where we are, where we will end up or well, are ending up at the moment. We're kind of aiming for just a top ten, maybe just below that with a mid-table finish from this season. Maitland Niles again getting the ball back for us. Border boost running into the box. Phillips 4 1. <laughs> We're tearing apart this Newcastle side that are in 20th at the moment. Tearing them apart. They haven't really put up a fight. Thought it was going to be a decent game once they got their goal back, but haven't really put up a fight since then. As I said, that they might go get a pull, one bow, or they've put it wide. Phillips now. Looking to maybe get a fifth goal here, West Brom. Phillips almost wins it back again. Great tackle again from Maitland Niles. Oh, sorry, it was Dean De Garner, not Maitland Niles. So Pereira's got a free kick here. Don't think he's going to shoot. He's going to maybe try and whip it into a bit of space. Is he does? Oh! Is it a corner now? Border boost. Into Maitland Niles on the edge. Into Phillips. West Brom have Tottenham in the next game maybe that's where reality starts to sink in that we aren't going to get top 10 finish by getting beat by the top 6 or big 6 teams but at the moment we've done well so we've only played mid table teams really a great tackle. Dean Garner. Maybe it's time to think about making some subs. Just get some minutes into the reserve players in the late stage of these ga in this game. To say we are four one up. Oh, poor pass. I'm going to bring Conor Gallagher on. I 
and we'll bring Richards on for Dian Garner. Three players then that haven't really had a chance to play in the league. Obviously Roberts, Robinson coming on as a sub some of the time. Gallagher not really playing since pre-season. Richard's not playing at all. So it'll be a nice 15 minutes for these, just to get a feel for the Premier League. As we enter the la about to enter the last tw uh, there, 10 minutes. Oh, great save by Button there. It's a great save to keep it at 4 1. Ajayi into Maitland Niles. Oh, Phillips has been called offside. So the three subs come on then. Robinson into Richards, the two subs linking up already. Pereira. Couldn't quite get it through. Or well, couldn't quite get through and then pass it in, but... Oh, my controls died. That's not something you want to see. Booty boost into the box. He passes it in for Robinson. Oh, how that's not five-one. We don't know. In the last minute of the game, or last couple of minutes, shall I say? Gamboa gives it to Phillips into Robinson. And that's full time. 4 1 win for West Brom then. Up north in Newcastle. And Bailly's loaned in. That goalkeeper that was on about loaning in. I think he's going to be a bench warmer really now that I've seen Button play. At the moment we're fifth in the league, so we're in the Europa League places at the moment. We've had a great start, only losing one game. Who was that loss against? I had a 4-0 loss against West Ham. On the stream last night. We've got Spurs, United, Swansea and then Leicester. Well, that's going to be the end of this episode. I'll try and get posted as quick as I can. <laughs> Make sure to like and subscribe. And good.